Hello, everyone. An employee by the name of Trey Kara Lachelle Ford has been accused of smuggling drugs at the Fulton County Jail. It all started Saturday. She is a contracted medical assistant for the jail. According to the police, she returned to work smelling like marijuana. A security guard named Lucinda questioned her. That is when Trey Kara ran out of the doors to her black Nissan. Before that happened, she was already being watched for having conversations with the inmates in the jail. When the guard asked her, she said no. She hadn't been smoking. Later, she admitted to smoking with the windows down. They also have her smoking weed on her Instagram page. The 24-year-old is faced with five felony charges because she left her bag behind. Let's take a look at what she had in her bag. Pat Labatt says he anticipates the contents of a backpack brought to the Fulton County Jail will change the status of the young woman who allegedly brought it from jail medical assistant to jail inmate. About 20 grams of suspected crack cocaine, 6.8 ounces of suspected marijuana, 200 cigarettes, and two packs of bugler tobacco. Tobacco, he says, is like gold inside the jail. The sheriff says medical assistant Tricara Ford, we found these images on Instagram, who worked for a contractor in the jail, faces a variety of charges, including possession of cocaine with intent to distribute, possession of marijuana with intent to distribute, and crossing guard lines of jail with prohibited items. The deputies also have a recorded phone conversation of her speaking with the inmates. She stated, I bought saran wrap and coffee. I know what I'm doing. Let's take a look at her Instagram. Post. You go back to jail, don't call my phone. We found these images of Ford on her Instagram page. Several posts shows her showcasing marijuana. Although these dates show 2017 and 2020, it still shows proof that she smokes marijuana or sells it. Ford is being charged with possession of marijuana with intent to distribute, possession of manufactured distribution or sale of marijuana, possession of cocaine with intent to distribute, crossing guard lines of jail with prohibited items, obstruction of law enforcement officer, or fleeing attempting to elude a police officer. I am so sorry to hear this about her. We have to be careful what we post on the internet because we don't know who is watching or when it would be used as evidence for certain situations. Now she may go to prison for trying to smuggle drugs to inmates. With that being said, she probably was dating one of them. These inmates don't care about anything but surviving in the jailhouse. They will leech off whoever they can until they get out. And after that, they will act as if they don't even know you. Well, this concludes this video. Let me know what you think in the comments. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe if you want to see more videos. Hit the red bell. Until next time, bye-bye.